Hello, those of you that uh, are interested in the Kawasaki ZX7R. Um, one of the things that comes up on a lot of the forums, whether Kawi forums, ZX forums, even on Red Monkey, is the infamous gray wire. And uh, it's an issue that seems to happen a lot with the ZX7. The CDI needs uh, 6 volts. It's basically an anti theft deterrent that Kawasaki came up with that. You can't jump it with 12 volts, it'll just fry the CDI, and then you can't steal the bike. So they uh, resist it down, 100 ohm resistor within the ignition switch. And what it is is 6 volts to the CDI. And sometimes the solder joint goes out, the resistor goes out, and also the connectors get burned up or whatever. So here's a couple different ways to test that. And uh, one of them is down here. Here wiring harness goes in through the frame and you're able to just pull it out and right there is that gray wire now back on the CDI there you see it right up top there infamous gray wire so back here one way to test it turn the ignition switch to on And then down here, you can take your meter, set it to about 20 volts, and then you back probe. Do not disconnect that connector. Leave it connected and you'll see the 6 volts. If you disconnect it, you'll see 12 volts. Now, we'll come up with a back probe and just stick it in there. And here we have 5.43. Back probe out, back probe in, 5.43. Now, we can come back here, and as I said, gray wire is right there. We'll back probe there, and 5.43. So, on the CDI, this is a 93 ZX7, but the same principles apply for the 96 Plus, and also the 91 and 92, and so forth. So the connector there, and the connector there. Back probe. Don't disconnect those connectors to test that. And then you see about that infamous gray wire.